is Insane Paintballer, and um, today I'm going to do a review of my Remington Airmaster 77 BB slash pellet rifle. Alright, I'm going to start out with how this gun is built. Alright, this gun is very durable, very solid, very well built. This whole receiver right here, all of this, is all metal. Um, the trigger is metal right here. The safety right here is metal. All of that is metal. Alright, this all is metal, this whole receiver. The stock is plastic right here. Very dense, durable plastic. Alright, as I said, the trigger is metal. This bolt right here, it is plastic. But, this you see the breech right here? The cover is plastic on the breech. But, inside the, the breech is all metal. Alright. Now, uh, this part right here of the gun, which is where you take it, where you p pull it out to pump it, which I'll show you in just a second. That is plastic, made the same material as the stock right here. Um, the metal right here, I mean, the metal, the barrel right here is all metal. It's like a stainless steel um, type of material, metal. Alright, the sights right here, this sight right here in the front is plastic. It has fiber optic sights right here. These are iron sights right here. They are adjustable for windage. Alright, let's flip over the gun. I'll show you the magazine right here in just a second while I talk about loading the gun. Um, that this little handle right here for the magazine is plastic all right now for the ammo that this gun takes this gun uh shoots 0.177 caliber ammo bbs or pellets the which is equivalent to four and a half millimeters i like to use these type of bbs copperhead bbs which i've shown you in my other video of my uh crossman pro 77 review all right I got these daisy pellets right here. Um, I like to use Crossman pellets more, but um, or better. But this is what I got right here for now. .177 caliber. All right. This is what a .177 caliber pellet looks like. I got pointed pellets. Of course, you can get hollow points. This is what a BB looks like. Pretty much is like all BBs. All right. Um, I've got the scope right here. This is what came with the gun. I just don't have it on the gun right now because I haven't had a chance to home it in or adjust it for the sights. But it's a very good scope, especially for something that would come with the gun. Alright. And this is the Crossman Cross Block trigger guard right here. And what you do, this comes with the gun. You put it on the trigger like this. And it'll latch onto the other side. And all you gotta do is just take a three prong key right here and put it in the hole to get it out. Alright, now for loading this gun. Alright, for BBs, all you gotta do is open this little cap right here. And you put your BBs into there, that little hole. The stock can hold up to 200 BBs for storage. Alright, but when you get done with that, you close that. Alright, now, put some in the magazine. All you gotta do is pull this little notch back and shake the BBs down until you get your desired amount. Alright, that's all I need for now for demonstration purposes. Alright, then all you gotta do is pump your gun um, like this. Let me show you. Pump it like that. And I usually do about six to seven pumps, eight to ten if you wanna be uh, have a really powerful shot. But this gun goes about goes up to about a thousand FPS very uh, powerful then all you gotta do after that just cock the breech right here and as you can see you'll get a BB that will go into the chamber you just push it forward take your safety off and you're ready to fire alright now for shooting pellets it's a little different you do not need the magazine at all but all you gotta do is open the breech and you just uh, put a pellet in there, um, like load them singly, one at a time. All right. But anyway, that's how to load the gun. Now, all right. Let me talk about the accuracy. 
this gun is extremely accurate, right? Uh, like for even long distances up to 40 yards, 50 yards, um, even probably 60. I mean, this gun is like dead accurate. The sights are really nice. Let's see if I can get you a good view there. That fiber optic sight at the bottom really helps. Um, I mean, this gun is also very powerful. It'll go through like a whole 300 page book, just clean shot, no problem. But this gun is extremely accurate. I love it. Summary of the gun is it's very well built, um, extremely accurate. It also feels good on the shoulder with the stock. Um, it's not too heavy, but it is kind of heavy. Um, and it's also very powerful. And I've just got this Hops gun oil right here because that's what I used to lube my guns when um, I'm maintenancing them or whatever you call it, taking care of them. But yeah, that's what I use for my maintenance on my guns. Alright, but this is my review of my Remington Airbuster 77. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, this is an insane paintballer. Please uh, comment. Thanks for watching.